Hi, it's Jeffrey again from Rubik's Academy. So today I want to just make this a very short video. Okay, very, very short video. Uh, because later on I have to rush off for a webinar. So this video will be a very short one. But it's an important video. It is still an important video. All right. In this video, I'm going to highlight all the books that I think every investor needs to read. Okay, I know it's a period where my information is readily available. You can just type Google and then you can find your information whatsoever or whatsoever. But books, whether it's an ebook or a physical book, offer a good gateway towards understanding certain critical principles in investing. And from time to time, it's always good to get a reminder of those critical, critical principles. All right, let's go. Number one, in terms of personal finance, I recommend Rich Dad Poor Dad by Robert Kiyosaki. Uh, Robert Kiyosaki, just this book I recommend, all right? Uh, I'm not going to comment on him in any way, but I will say that for this book at least, it's a very good book for personal finance because it allows you to understand the concept of income. It allows you to understand the concept of what is considered financial freedom. Of course, a lot of these are gurus have been mis- abusing the word financial freedom, right? Uh, I'm sure you have seen those ads promising you financial freedom as long as you go for the course. Uh, again, no comments, but I will never take those courses. Just my opinion. Okay, so this book gives you a very good sense of what is true financial freedom, how to achieve financial freedom, what are the different classifications of financials, uh, financial independence, what is the direction that you should proceed as an individual? Where are you right now? How are you right now? How should you be proceeding to the next stage? Whether you should be proceeding to the next stage? What are the things to be taken care of? What are the mentality setbacks that you will suffer if you try to proceed to the next stage of financial independence? This book details, writes all that in, in a very structured manner. So, recommend this book, Rich Dad, Poor Dad, by Robert Kiyosaki. Next book is The Essays of Warren Buffett. Now, for those of you, this, this is basically a compilation of all the letters of Warren Buffett to the Berkshire Hathaway shareholders. Okay? Now, through his essays, you will understand how institutional finance works. That's number one. Number two is, through his essays, you will understand the critical principles of value investing why he invests in certain stocks at certain times, why he wants to do certain things at certain times, why he sells, why he buys at certain times. He explains all that to his investors. Okay, so another critical book that you need to read. All right, it's a compilation. It's not really a book. It's a compilation of all the letters that he wrote. Number three, how to make money in stocks. Now, this one, you literally have a free PDF right here. Okay, uh, it's a very long book. You can see the words are very, very big as well. But if you go through your chapters, you can see that basically, if you are a beginner in investing, you are a beginner in terms of value investing, this is the book that you need to read. Okay, because you will understand how companies work, you will understand what makes a good company, what makes a profitable company, and what makes a loser company, what makes a losing company, and what are the red flags, what are the kind of red tapes that you need to understand when you invest into a company. What are the key factors driving a company's growth? It details all that in the book. Okay? You can look at the chapters. Very simple. All right? The book, the last book that you read is The Intelligent Investor by Benjamin Graham. All right? Uh, this book is the book the book that started the whole spur of value investing causes. So many value investing causes, whether it's US, whether it's Singapore, whether it's Malaysia, all draw their principles from this book. This book, together with Warren Buffett's essays of Warren Buffett's, you read these two books, you will get a very clear idea, a very good guiding idea on what is value investing. All right, so these four books I recommend. Okay, if you have missed those titles, scroll back, watch the video again. All right, thank you very much. My name is Jeffrey. I hope to see you in the next video. Thank you.